Gary, um, I need you to pick 10 Chelsea players that you would not want to lose. The ones you don't pick, you cannot sell. So it's not a financial decision, right? So it's not like, oh, I'm not going to pick Enzo because I would sell him. No, 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 no. The oh. you don't pick are just gone forever. Okay, so it's not a financial decision. It's 10 Chelsea players you just don't want to lose. The only ones you don't have to worry about, not that you would ever pick these guys, would be academy players, okay? So okay. Tyreek Georges, Achempongs, they'll still be here. But if you want to keep like a Kendry and Rishtevao, then you would have to include them on this list. Loneys count. Andre Santos, let's do Gochukwu, okay? Those players do count. So 10 Chelsea players you would not want to lose. In in order? Nope, not in so order. Like, okay. Not in order. I feel like everyone's done Palmer at number one, so we might as well get that one out of the way. Mm. Um, I've got Nkunku and Jackson. Uh, Daily, you'll have a chance to change yours in a couple months. We'll redo this. Purely, well, not purely based on how much I like him, but it, yeah, Gusto. I, was, I, didn't, I didn't even say it, you knew. Um, oh my God. Uh, Colwell. Dave is such a clown. He really is. Uh, Kukurea. Uh, how many is that? One, two, three more. Uh, Vega. Okay. Now three more. <laughs> uh, Caicedo and Lavia. And then my last one is... Oh, this is the tricky one because they're... It's between... Carney, Neto and Madueke. Hold on. You would go Carney over a Steval? Oh, wait, hang on. So you're you're including players that aren't that, that are loan. You, you well. have to include loan. You have to oh, include loan. I okay. Um. Okay, I might have to take some people out then. Or no. Okay, so Esteval. And now is it one more? One, two, no, three, done four, ten now. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. And I'm looking through. It's hard because um, I will take Vega out for Sancho, which pains me. Wow. Okay. Interesting. I wanted to put Neto in, but I just don't feel like I can. My list is smelly. Don't I wouldn't. Put, I wouldn't. Chat. I wouldn't. Don't put, listen to the chat. That's no, no, I'm not. I'm not. No, no, no. Yeah. I'm sticking with my guns. Okay. I did. Un- I did misunderstand though with 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 the fact that um, yes, Lonnie's including count. players like that. Lonnie's yeah. Count. Okay. He would have put in Kendry if he didn't just learn that he vaped. <laughs> yeah. How much did the vaping change your uh, list there? Um. Quite a bit, I would say. Harry, oh, I'll v- vaping's very very in. bad for you. So if you want to see, this is coming um... from the guy who. Um... <laughs> We gotta get the game back on, so hurry up, runner. Well, I'm done. I don't know if you want to have him look at this. Well, I would rather the, the game back on. All right. I feel like everyone would have put, for the most part, I could see a few people missed out. Reese, he's the one that's tricky because oh, I'd... Reese has been only chosen by like half. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It, it's a strange one, isn't it? But he is my he he's been my favorite player for years, but it's just I, I can't in good conscience put him in that list because he just yeah. doesn't play ever. So oh. when we, when we do this again in, when we do this again in like two and a half months, Reese is either gonna go way up because he's been fit or he's gonna go way down because he hasn't been fit. Yeah. Yeah. Who chose Sanchez? Who do you think? I don't know if you know this show well enough, but who do you think? Is it someone that I would know? You should. I mean, I feel like someone said it in the chat, so that's kind of ruined it. But Robert. I was thinking... And I'll, I'll expand on that. What oh. you need to do 
Yep. Uh, what you need to do is you need to pick 10 Chelsea players that if all the other clubs in the world were coming to take all of our players, you would protect these 10. So what I mean by that is you are just holding these players so no one else can get them. The ones you don't choose. So, for instance, I always use this example, but if for some reason you didn't choose Enzo Fernandez, your reasoning behind that cannot be, oh, well, instead of keeping him, I'll sell him for 80 million or 100 million or whatever. Whomever you don't choose, it's not a financial decision. You don't get to sell them. They're just gone forever. Okay. So it's not like, uh, you know, I didn't choose Caicedo because I can sell him for a bunch of money. No, 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 no. If you don't choose them, they're just gone. So the only players you don't need to worry about in terms of choosing them and you'll, you'll still have them would be like pure academy players. So like Tyree George, Joshua Chempong, don't worry about those guys. Those guys, we won't make part of this exercise. But, but, Estevao, Kendry, Andre Santos, Ugo Chukwu, those guys are kind of out on loan and stuff. You would have to choose them if you want to keep them. So if you didn't choose, say, Andre Santos or Kendry or Estevao, then they would be gone forever. Um, so, yep. Oh, okay. Pick 10. No, no, so, no they, so they, so they, ca- they yep. count as Chelsea players. They would count. Correct. Okay. They would count. So, um, yeah, no, you don't have to do it in any order. Obviously, you don't have to make an 11 because you're only doing 10 players anyway. Yeah. And, you know, in this hypothetical world, then whomever you didn't choose, whatever positions you still needed, you could fill on the market and all that. So just 10 Chelsea players that you would want to keep. Okay. And so does this injury record take into account of this? Like say I Reese James. Yeah. I mean, whatever your rationale is mm. like, that's the thing is, you know, however you want to go about this, there's no wrong or right answers. This is okay. just who, who Neil Robertson would not want to lose basically. Okay. Not want to lose. Okay. Uh, well, I, I guess everyone would probably say Cole Palmer first, right? I'm not going to do it in order, by the way, but I think that Cole is like just the first one that springs to mind. Yeah, you can get him out of the way. I, I will say, Neil, to this point, he is our only unanimous player. We've done this now with probably about 27 people or so. He's our <laughs> only unanimous player. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Um, Actually, uh, Alex, but bye-bye. Hi, Neil. Oh, um, hey, how you going? 31. Nero's our 31st person. Oh, we've done it with 30. Okay, you're our 31st person, so Cole is the only unanimous one. Wow. A 10. Uh... Okay, Starvo William as well. Um... Uh, Casado? Definitely don't want to lose him. He's playing very well. Um, uh, Colwell. Um, what's that? One, two, three, four. Who I definitely don't want to lose. Uh, um. I'm going to say Nico Jackson as well because I just think he's got huge potential. Oh. Defender. Hmm. Uh, Wesley Fafana as well. I think him and Cole, are, they're improving all the time together. Um, geez. Oh, who else? All oh, uh, oh, right, <laughs> the chat didn't. A couple didn't like the Jackson pick. <laughs> no, that's all right. It's very important, probably, while you do this, to not be influenced by the chat. Yeah, I know. No, but like, yeah, no. I'm I'm sticking with Jackson. I'm sticking with Jackson. He's yeah. he's a huge promise, and he, people don't people often overlook his age as well, like a lot of the players that we have. Um, I think it's important. I think it's important for us to also. Oh, I don't know if you can hear my daughter kicking off there. <laughs> <laughs> it actually happens on this show more than you would think. We have my, my son's here. winding her up. There's a nine-year age gap, and uh, my son is, is uh, driving her bananas. Um, who would I say as well? Uh, so 
Uh, I definitely don't want to lose Kukurea either. You know, I never thought I'd be saying this a year ago, but I think, you know, being a winner, um, you know, he's just a, a man completely transformed this season. He's been so important for us. Um, how many am I at now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I've got to go with Kendry Paez as well. I just think he's another super talent. I'm really excited to see how... Um, how him and, and uh, Stavo William get on next season with us as well with Cole in the team. That's yeah. going to be that's going to be tough for uh, Mareska to, to squeeze all that in. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I got two left. Two more. Who do I not want to see? So the funny thing is, in a few months' time, like we might just have at eight or nine, just absolutely nailed on. Um, yeah yeah we're gonna revisit these even in like three months everybody can do a new list in three months and i guarantee you there will be some changes for sure for everyone probably mm, mm. i mean reese james would be in there if it wasn't for his injury situation right um you know and and even if you look at lavia as well like uh, yeah another one just like yeah i'd love i'd love to come back to this in a few months and hopefully reese is back fit and lavia is back fit you know yep. um Wait, have I done nine? Oh, no, I've done eight. Um, two more. Um, the fact that I'm saying keeping Estavio William and uh, with Kendry Paez means that uh, I'm not totally sort of uh, attached to, say, Madwaki and Sancho. And, right. Look, M Mudrick could be on this list in a few months' time if he keeps improving the way he has done the last few weeks. Um, I definitely don't want to lose. I'm going to go with uh, I'm going to go with I'm going to take a leap of faith here and I'm going to go with Lavia. Okay. And one more. One more. Um, wow. It would be, jeez, oh, yeah, I don't know, maybe Gusto. I really like Gusto. Um, oh, someone's just actually put that in the chat as well. <laughs> did, every, did everyone? Did everyone take as long as me on this? Oh God, no, 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 no. We we just had Louis and Jade. I mean, granted, it was two people, but no, you're probably average speed on this average. Okay, okay, last one. Um. I'm just trying to think. I mean, it's hard, right? In a good yeah, way, it's it is hard. because, you know? yeah. like, there's there's players who I'm really happy with, but you know, I'm, we're we're talking like players that I definitely do not want to leave. Right. Um. I'd say because of his age and how much he's improved and how well he did for us last season, and he seems quite versatile. Uh, I'm gonna go with um. I'm gonna go with Gusto. I'm gonna go with Gusto. Nice. Even though he didn't have his best game against Forrest, but I just think, you know, so young, huge potential, and has proven that he can actually sort of invert into midfield as well, right? Which is pretty key for us. So yeah. I'm kind of basing it on um, uh, the system that um, Mariska wants to play. Who, what's the what's going on here with the green, yellow, orange, and gray? Uh, that's just Reinhardt and his and his fun color coding that he does. Reinhardt's going to write your list down now next to all the other ones and. Andre Santos, that, yeah. I, I kind of went yeah. with Flavio over Santos. I, I couldn't choose two, two, two sure. sentiments. So, so over there on the right is uh, the tallies so far of the players. So obviously on the top, you have Cole Palmer with, um, you know, unanimous. Uh, Caicedo and Colwell have been one off being unanimous. Oh, them. nice. Okay, so I've pretty yeah. much... Oh, so I've 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 gone with you have the, a good uh, list. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would say your list is is closer to a consensus list. I would say that on the consensus list, if uh, the the top ten, I think it stops at Nkuku. I think it's Nkuku Gusto, yeah. uh, Nkuku Gusto, Reese, Lavia, Jackson, Kendry, Esteval, Caldwell, Caicedo, Palmer. You have a good amount of them. Um, obviously, the only like.